we have to look at it for what it is. It's, it's organized crime on a very massive scale. It involves not just the, the wildlife at stake, but the people, the economies, um, and whole regions of the world. Many are surprised to learn that illegal wildlife trade is one of the largest criminal activities in the world. In fact, it ranks among the world's top illegal trades. On the scale of illegal black markets, you know, the usual sorts of things like drugs and human trafficking, wildlife sits at the top five. The value of the black market for illegal wildlife is estimated to be between seven and ten billion dollars annually. The amount of money that is made by illegal wildlife trade is enormous. I mean, this is not one individual or a few individuals going around killing a few animals, as bad as that would be, and that would be bad. But it is wholesale slaughter of animals. The people who conduct, who finance wildlife trade and who are making the big money from it are some of the same people who are involved in the trade in drugs, guns, human trafficking, things. These dangerous organized criminal elements are not just endangering wildlife and worldwide national and regional security. They are also directly threatening the lives of people in the regions in which they operate. You have another type of a poacher, which is quite dangerous now. So they will come in armed, uh, looking for a rhino specifically. They normally come in uh, with, obviously they come in with rifles, um, your AKs. 